Jubé is one of the celebrations that happens in Carnival in Trinidad and Tobago. So Carnival is one of the biggest celebrations of the year, maybe the biggest. And to start off the two day, official two days of the event, there's a parade called Juve. Juve is from French Patois, it means daybreak. So the parade happens around 4 a.m. and they parade around the city with mud and paint and music. And then it, from Juve, there are other parades for the next two days. So the Caribbean Students Association was formed last spring but in the middle of spring because this is the first year that we've had enough Caribbean students to actually have our own SIG um, and we thought we wanted to share our culture with the wider community. A lot of our events throughout the semester were targeted towards like bringing more education about the Caribbean, bringing more awareness and exposure about the region since it's so small and there are a lot of misconceptions about it and we ended the semester with our Caribbean Culture Week which was centered around Carnival which is one of the events celebrated throughout the Caribbean and which has a big misconception because often when you think of Carnival you think of Brazil and Brazil has a very big Carnival but it's actually a very big thing in the Caribbean as well. The history of Carnival which came from liberated slaves um, under French colonial rule kind of mocking the French and so on. Um, this the historical elements often play into how the mass is done, such as the old mass, which we had some posters around. The paint and powder aspect is something that I think is very important because at home, um, the primary spreading thing is mud. However, here, we can really find good mud. So we had the powder and the paint and the water, which are also involved. But now it's the, we have pretty mass and new mass, which is very colorful, and which is why we had the headpiece as well a lot of different elements of carnival that if I were to go to everything we'd probably be here till tomorrow or better yet just come to Trinidad or any of the Caribbean countries and see it yourself. Where the Caribbean is, what what exactly is the Caribbean that it goes beyond um, reggae and, and roti for example. The Caribbean has more than 20, 25 countries and often it's forgotten that even though we're all very tiny we're a very large region and that span North and South America, which is often another misconception. The Caribbean, specifically countries like Trinidad, Guyana, Jamaica, they have very strong multi-ethnic communities. So in Trinidad, the majority of population is, is Indian. Here, most of the Trinidadians are African descent or mixed um, with African descent, so that people always get surprised when I say, yes, there are white people in Trinidad, there are Chinese in Trinidad, that we are actually a multi-ethnic, multi-religious, multi-diverse community that's living together fairly in peace. If you don't know anything about the Caribbean, you want to know more, just come up to any of the students from the Caribbean. Trust me, you'll know who we are because we have very strong accents. And if you didn't understand what I said here, all the more reason to come up to me and we can discuss it. Yeah.